well, on the top of Bofell, well, Bofell's just behind me, up there. The cloud has really come in now, and I must admit, it is freezing. My fingers are all really cold, I'm going to put my gloves on in a minute, but uh, it's really well worth it. It's only taken us a few hours to get up here. I was hoping for a better view. Apparently, these views are supposed to be really good, but not at this moment in time. I've hung around for a little while to see if the weather cleared, but not yet, but um, we live in hope. I must admit, I love walking. As a foster carer, it can be challenging times, and I must admit, last week was very challenging. And it's just nice to get out, have a bit of time, think about just just the walk and being out in nature. And it's so good for your mental health. And it's really good for mine, actually. Uh, sometimes you just need to get out and get away from it all. Hence why I'm here in training still for Mount Tuchel in January. That's uh, what, just over what, five weeks away now. So today it's Bofell, tomorrow we'll see how the weather is. I'm hoping for Helvellyn, but uh, if it's like this, then I might have to change plans. Or if it does close in even worse, then uh, I might have to look something a bit lower down. But uh, hopefully, fingers crossed, the weather will pick up tomorrow and uh, it'll be a better day. But I'm going to head back down now, so I'll talk to you later. Thanks a lot. So now I'm coming down back to the campsite. You can see where I've come from, up there, which is Bofell. It's so much better now. Which was like this when I was at the top, so I couldn't see nothing, but all the way down it's really nice. So on the other side of there, you've got the Scarfells and Scarfell Pike. So there's a lot of um, great scenery around now. I'm going to back down, he's put the tent up, sort some tea out, and then uh, have a look uh, what we're going to do later on. Because there's no signal whatsoever at the campsite, so I have to drive out find some Wi-Fi so I can call home, make sure everything's okay. But uh, it's been a good day. So both fell, really nice walk. Very distinct path. A few uh, tricky bits, but uh, that's to be expected. But a uh, well laid path and fairly easy to navigate, which was quite good, because this morning going up there, it was a bit of a pea super. But, uh, on the way down it cleared. It might be an actually lovely evening. I think the forecast is it's going to be quite cold tonight, so need to wrap up warm in that tent. But I've got a good sleeping bag. I think, I think you can just make out Bofell in the distance over there. It's just in the behind that, but really nice walk. Such a lovely part of the world. Nice to get back before it's too dark. Then I'll be setting up in the pitch dark and getting everything laid out because it's not ideal. Do it when it's light, makes it far easier. And I get out tomorrow, make the plans, get the map out, and see where I want to go. And say Helvellyn's looking like oh, that's the one I want to really do. I'll finish off, I think, most of my top 10 rain rights for the highest ones. Scaffold being the highest. I think Bofell's number 6. And uh, I think Helvellyn's number 3. So, really making a dent into them now. Mm -hmm.